Dolvine here, Dolvine.com. Uh, doing a EGR valve pipe. I'm showing you how to replace that on a 2005 Chevy Equinox. Um, you'd think it would be easier than uh, than it turned out to be. I thought it would be an easy fix, but here's your EGR valve pipe. And then here's what the EGR valve looks like. So if you look in here, here is, I'm going to turn, turn it around. Okay, it's not letting me. Okay, so there's your EGR valve. And there's your pipe. So there's a bolt there, and then there's two bolts on the bottom. So as you can see, there's two bolts here on the bottom, and then a bolt on the top. But the thing is, when you buy this pipe, they stop making this pipe this size, and they change the valve. So you have to... I had a crack, as you can see. Sorry to film on here. There's a crack in there, so I needed to replace the valve pipe. So I tried doing that, and I bought a new thing, and the pipe was not long enough. So the pipe they give you is like 9 inches. This is 11, and there's no way you can get that pipe to fix without retrofitting retrofitting the EGR valve <laughs> and then getting a new valve. So what I did, I went online and I bought a used good pipe, but a lot of these pipes, they just cut these pipes to get to the valve because that's what um, they need the valve. So it might be a little hard finding just a pipe, but I mean, if you find it, it's cheap. There's a lot of them out there. Um, it was just a headache trying to figure out why the pipe did not fit and then it took the guy a while to realize that they retrofitted it. So it's an easy fix. It's three bolts. Want make sure your engine's hot, not hot when you're changing it. Um, so I didn't actually have to replace the valve, but um, since it was right there, it's just two more bolts. So just a tip that make sure you get the right pipe. You might have to order a used one that's not correct online, but um, yeah, it should just be an easy fix. They'll charge you like 200 some bucks for it at least at a shop, and you can get right to it. That's what it looks like. Um, these pipes tend to crack easy on these models, but um, just a tip, you're going to have to get the right pipe and that's all you need. Look online at them used auto parts or go to a salvage yard if you got one near you. Um, just thought I'd give that a tip because it was kind of annoying how I had to find uh, the right pipe size and it was kind of a pain. But Alright, Dolzine, Dolzine.com.